have to edit that music out. What's up, man? Well, we are about 10 miles or so southwest of downtown Los Angeles at SoFi Stadium in Inglewood. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one between the Dallas Cowboys and oh, the Los Angeles Chargers. Need one right there. Greg Zerline now. He'll handle the honors to get us started. And we are underway in Southern California. On a return, Andre Roberts from his end zone. And ultimately, he's so out far. to the 25 yard line as he's dropped at the 23. If I can stop this offense. Here's the first carry for Austin Eckler. And he's able to plow forward up to about the 29, just shy of the 30. Five yards on the game's first play, second down. This one to Eckler and tackled down after a gain of three leaves him with one yard to go on third down just not a whole lot of room to operate there on that carry no not at all they did a really nice job staying in their proper places and not allowing any lanes to open up and he gets it to the 34 good enough for the first Defense had a chance to get off the field here in the opening drive, couldn't do it. I know that we go into these meetings with coaches and sometimes maybe we can get, you know, a little bit numb because they're always going to talk about how important third down is, aren't they? Offense and defense, in this case, one capitalized. The others, you said, had a chance to get off the field. And and totally get all right with that. Three yards the game there, second down. One thing we do know, he's going to get his catches. So as they move forward defensively, Got to continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the secondary. Come on, man. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. Well, one unit I know you want to watch is that offensive line. If they keep clearing holes like that, it could be a long night defensively. No doubt about it, because when they are in sync, as we're seeing so far, with that continuity is there, and you can see that they're playing off of each other while controlling the defensive front linebackers. You're exactly right. It could be a very long night for the defense because someone's going to get the garbage. And he is tackled really? inside the 40, not quite to the 35. And this was That's a nice right. example of an offensive coordinator first, scheming his guy open, just things. a little underneath route, just trying to free up some space, and it worked awfully well. Got him not just space, but plenty of room to run after the catch to pick up really nice yards. Say, I missed that. Nothing doing. Barely able to muster a yard to hit the 35. Well, sometimes you just have to give credit to the defense. Great job there at the point of attack, holding up. They won their battles at the line of scrimmage, left him no space to try and run. A really nice job swarming to the ball carrier. Meanwhile, and he caught it. He held on to it. Wow. He's going to have another first down here as the tackle's made at the Cowboys 19. Out of the gun, Eckler running it. And he's going to push his way down to about the 12. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. On the give, this is Eckler. He's able to work it here to the eight-yard line. Well, I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half. You've got to take some pressure off of this young quarterback, and no better way to do it than to establish the running game early. A terrific opening drive has them knocking on the door, first and goal. Justin Herbert looking to pass. This will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there, and it's second down. That's what you're going to need to do against those big receivers. You got to get in there and get physical with them. That time he got in close, got in tight, and knocked the ball away. And 
this will probably be the last play of the quarter. On second and goal. Herbert. Herbert has yes, been knocked free. If you don't tackle him. I can't strip the ball. I strip the ball. Can't pick the damn thing up. Charger football to start quarter number two. Oh, As they'll see what they can do on third and goal. You must do better than that. Here's Herbert. You know where he's at. Looking for Allen, he's got him you on know the slam. Where he's at. That pass play good for seven, but it still brings up a fourth and goal. And he's already got two catches on the opening drive. <laughs> they know he's going to be a handful. And sometimes you game plan for that offensively. You want to make sure that guy touches the ball, and sometimes it just happens naturally. And then you change your game plan. When he has the hot hand, you keep going back to him because he's running routes with confidence as the game goes on. On fourth down, Herbert. I'm just saying, how, how did both of y'all miss the pick? It did, it he got the both. The fourth down pass attempt. And both this defense it. holds firm here on the opening drive of the night. I don't see how you, I missed the pick, and then I don't see how you missed the catch after I missed the pick. So Prescott and the Cowboys now with a first and 10 at their own 13. They'll try and start this drive in the air. A and how does he drop that? No coverage bust I don't mind taking the hit. Nice don't drop the ball. Come on. And that led to an incompletion. So after the incompletion on first, now second and 10. Prescott to throw it. And this one incomplete. That was good. Too much contact. That was good defense. That, one, and it's that was good down. defense. Over the dime look I, I can't take nothing from them. Backs on the field have covered up essentially every blade of grass. That allowed them to disrupt the play. On third down, it's Prescott. That open. That's complete to Tony Schultz. And he will have uh, the Cowboys first down. That's test you use to see if you can pick it. I got a kick out of that one, partner. You and I talk often about trying to hide receivers in certain situations, but a got guy him. of his size can't really hide it. But the tight end drag route, definitely an effective way to sneak him across the formation for an easy completion and a first down. And he gets this yeah, one. He can't drop all of them. Mark him down at the 39. <laughs> They'll throw again. Prescott. And that one drops down incomplete. Good well, your use ain't bad. I ain't gonna lie. I keep trying to test them, and it's, it's gonna see when we review this that the not pay off. Out quicker, I can see. Because if you don't throw it right on the break, you bring a crowd of people into the equation. And that's why it got knocked away there. Throwing again on second and ten. Prescott looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Schultz. Scott. It's too high. It's and too high. Too high. Too high. Strong, and now it's down. Five yards. Well, what what should I do? Just flooded the field with defense and no. backs, blanketed everyone. Hell, just away play good the football. Angles, thus the incompletion. Play good football. On fourth down, here's Brian Anger now to kick this one away. Back deep here, Andre Roberts. There you go. There you go. There you go. So he played good football. <laughs> and the Chargers will be backed up deep to begin their drive. Play good as football. They take over first and ten. <laughs> the Charger drive about to get going. They had a great drive going last time. They were moving the ball, and then all of a sudden it just stalled out. So we'll see what they can do here. Charles. Come on, that's a hit stick. Hit him. Second guess when you don't get it on a fourth down try. But they can't let him get four yards every time. 
They want to continue to see what they can capture that again oh. on this drive and maybe get in the same position. Yeah, and that's, I mean, like I said, they were moving the football. It's not like they went four and out, so I don't think it's a, a deal where the offense doesn't have confidence. No, I agree with you totally on that one. If, if anything, they may have gained more confidence. Okay, they stopped us once. That's all right. Let's keep moving it. Make them oh, do it shit. again. Herbert's throw is caught here by Anderson. And he takes us beyond oh, the 35 before going out of bounds. But when you hit him on the move like that, he's able to get into open field with a full head of steam. Oh, boy, it's going to be tough to get him down. Yeah, there was a big window. They're lucky they did get him down. Two minutes on the clock in what's been a scoreless first half. I know. I don't know why I didn't stop the clock. I agree with you on that one. We remind you that coming up at halftime, we'll take you to Orlando and Jonathan Coachman. Coach will have highlights and analysis. No, no, no. Let me go. First half, one that's featured no touchdowns as of yet on either side. So his job's a little bit easier for this halftime. He wouldn't let me switch me. Coach, some highlights here. Yes, we do. That was See how long it took me to see. Recognizing the situation, his first read wasn't there. Heck, his second read wasn't there. But he bought himself a little extra time scrambling out of the pocket, got to the sticks, and picked up the first down. Here's a throw out wide, complete to his running back right side, and this one goes nowhere. Losing yardage on the play back at the 46. That one unable to develop, never got going. A loss of a couple, and it's second down. Herbert. No. No fucking way. One deep left side here. And that will be incomplete. How did I pick it? Dial up the long way way out that there, little swerve you did didn't throw me off at all. I should have picked that ball. Easy for you. They're a physical group, and we just saw it there on that play. It came in, made the contact, just as he's trying to haul it in. And that is incomplete. More no, he's not wide open. Vander is all on top of I do in this league if you don't win on third down Andres was all over win a ball game because then you're relying on your defense you're relying on your special teams you've got to get it done with your offensive unit all right I got a guy playing football so let's go guys now on is the punter long here as he sends this one away Nice work on the return as he gets about 15 yards back. And the Cowboys About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. It was still more than a minute to go in the half. Time to try to mount a drive. And I would think that they would have to. This is today's NFL. you got to push it whenever you get an opportunity. You could never have it. There he goes, Amari Cooper. The 30, 10, 5, Let's touchdown, test Cowboys. Let's test the shooter. Amari <laughs> Cooper, 77 yards. And the Cowboys are able to show off their quick strike ability. Now Greg Zerline on for the extra point. Let's test this user. And this is up and good to make it 7-0 Cowboys. Oh, it's a lot of game left. You're playing too damn good to be worried. the touchdown at Zerline. He'll kick it away. Here's Roberts to bring it out of the end zone. <laughs> he said, I ain't coming out. <laughs> oh, my goodness. The Charger drive about to get going. And with just under a minute to go, they might try to think about mounting a drive here if they can and get in the end zone to potentially tie this game up. Let's see you. He'll get this to Eckler. Yeah, and I still can't stay with him. Good playmaker. The Chargers going to signal Good for the first play. of their timeouts. As they'll stop it with 40 seconds remaining in this first half. On first and 10, Herbert rolling oh, to his you. left. I definitely see you. 
I definitely see you. Definitely see you. And the Cowboys are going to get it back here just past the 35. I know it appeared he was saying, hey, give me the football, good. I'm open, but I don't know if that's a pass that he should have thrown there. Well, I don't think we've ever met a wide receiver that doesn't think he is open or is about to be open. <laughs> True. So when you throw your hand up in the air and tell your quarterback, hey, I'm available, he's trusting that you are. In this case, he was not. And it turned into disaster I just need for one them. Catch. And that one will fall oh, incomplete. Yeah, Clock here now, just under 30 seconds to go in this first half. Here's second and ten. From the shotgun, it's Prescott. Pick. And it's okay. knocked away and incomplete. There is something to a game plan with trying to keep a defense honest with a guy with that type of speed. You do so. Send him deep. Try to throw some air under it and hope you connect downfield. On that play, they run successful. Prescott from the gun. They'll roll him out right. And yeah, this is caught, but I don't think he stayed in bounds. He did stay in bounds. It's incomplete. I'm fucked up. took him past the boundary, and it's four. So it doesn't look like they're going to be able to build off the turnover. Well, the Even on the replay. Well, the did its part. It got him the football. But you're exactly right. It looks like they have to punt this one away. And it's not a turnover, but doesn't it feel like one after grabbing the momentum with the defensive play? Yeah, and they had all that momentum after getting the football, and now zapped right back in the other direction. Nice. Anger is on to punt, and he gets this one away. Hit him. It'll be a 44-yard boot, just a <laughs> yard on the return as he's covered up quickly. Yes, and control the football, switching hands with very little time remaining until the half. Can't allow no Hail Marys. The Charger drive about to get going as he'll take over with just 13 seconds to go before the break. Complete, and we're down to we're eight out. seconds now. So many times we talk about coverage, we're just about a defender running with a receiver. But a big part of it is understanding where the football is, finding it. In this case, when it arrived, it wasn't a surprise, and he was able to bat it away. And that will be incomplete. Four ticks left here on the clock. So much about defending the pass is being able to be right there the moment the ball gets to the receiver. And he was right in his hip pocket, helping force that incompletion. A final shot before the break for Herbert. You can have it. This is caught, but I don't think he stayed in bounds. No, he didn't. It's incomplete. The throw took him past the boundary, and it's fourth. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step I don't aside. Trust this. this is the NFL on EA Sports. Alright. As soon as it, it won't let me pause it. So Okay. The Cowboys will get the football first here, and they have the lead as well as we are underway in quarter three. And hey, no you can pause this man. one is a fair catch. A signal four and take it. Do what you got to do. That's what I. I'm in Arkansas, man. Where are you at? Oh, we. It's still bad down there. I know. Yeah, last time I was down, that was bad. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Hey Charles, they got the lead. Put your coaching hat on here now. What's I, the game plan for the second reason. half? I think getting the running game going a little bit more because I thought the Why did he half, stop? I'm gone. Nothing in front of me. They had success throwing it, but I think these first couple of drives, they'll want to get 
those running backs going and give them more opportunities, and I will guarantee you that those guys were lobbying for them in the locker room at halftime. On second and seven, Prescott. He's going to flip one out here. Yeah. Back. <laughs> and they get yeah. Down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Nope. Nope. I like the play design no, there. nope. The Nobody ever prepares for that. Field. Nobody prepares for, for it. Someone, Everybody always looks at Cooper the on the other side. So. The and he and you drop two wheels over point. there. And... Huh? Yeah, you just... Gotcha. A first down carry by Elliot. And Come he's on, take Elliot. That's a whole big attack. But no more than that. Second down. On Let's second see. and seven. Let's test the user. Let's test the user. That's Cooper. <laughs> Let's and test the user. The ground with another first down at the Chargers 43. Let's test it. Elliot, toss right. Come. Looking for a cutback. You're blocking. Go around the block, the man. I like it. Here's Prescott. Pick. I knew I threw the pick. I knew I threw it when I let it go. I knew I threw the pick when I let it go. You heard me call for it before you even picked it. This defense was hoping for an interception on the opening possession of this third quarter. Obviously, didn't want to surrender a touchdown and fall even farther behind. And we've gotten to know this team. I think I can pick it back, though. Couldn't you just see their defensive leaders telling the offensive guys, telling the quarterback, don't worry, we got you to start things off? You I thought Vanderish was going to jump the pants, but he just was being lazy. And let's face it, you can put any Halloween costume on him. You're not going to be able to disguise him because for a tight end of his size, difficult to sneak him anywhere, but that's what they tried to do. Lined up on his right, tried to work his way back to his left, but just a minimal gain as the defense was able to he react He just plays smart football, so you got to play smart unselfish football. unselfish players on any let's football go. team. Defensive tackles, because we asked them to just eat up blocks and allow other people to make tackles. But when he can make a play himself, as we just saw there, that's a big day. You gotta be kidding. Diggs can't catch that? Come on, Diggs. Think it all came together there. In breaking route, drove it with excellent pace. Money throw right there to move the sticks. I think they got it. Off the play fake to Eckler, it's Herbert. That is caught. It's Williams. Good one. That was a good one. Mike Williams. 36 yards. That was a good one. And the Chargers have a chance to tie the ball game here in the final game. I'll give you hell of credit for that. Can't take nothing from the third. This is damn good for it. Hopkins with the extra point. And that will tie our game here in the third. You know I got to let you have it now, don't you? Square here in this third quarter as the I gotta do away. something back because you celebrated on me and that kind of hurt my feelings. Pollard to return from the end zone and ultimately cannot get this out to no, the sir. Uh, I'll protect that ball for our fumble. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys. I think offense. I got it. And there are parts of their last drive they'd like to emulate. Of course, they'd like to forget the ending, the interception. But they did put together Charles a nice sustained drive to get him down the field. <laughs> yeah, and unfortunately yep. for them, the that was your user part too, right? Because once they threw the interception and finished off the drive, that does them no good to go back and say, "Well, you know, we had a good one going." Finish things off. That's the only way you can get it done. Meanwhile, the throw here is complete, and they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. Why are you trying to block my uh, route? Oh, first down. 
That's just mean, man. I ain't do nothing to you to preemptively try to block a thing, man. Right? I just want to run my little, little this long. Break. You're watching the NFL a little round. on EA Sports. I know. That's why I say I just want to run my little route. You just trying to preemptively get in the spot the that I want to be in. Now. Here's first and ten. That's just me. They keep on the ground with Elliott. A gain of three, second down. Let's check his user. There's Prescott. Let's check his He's user. <laughs> check his user. <laughs> and he'll go out of bounds in the red zone. Let's check running. that user. And partner in a tie game in the fourth quarter. You and I both know in the NFL. That's when you lose keep on checking his user. With a nice catch right there. Mm. Don't throw no picks. Down. It will be good. Italian. Come on. Like Elliot, you're faster than that. They stop him behind the line. Maybe just a slight detour on what's been a strong drive. Here's second and 11. Again, it's Elliott. And okay. nothing doing. He's immediately taken down. I already made a mistake. The third down now. Those last two plays indicative of how things have gone for them. Just nowhere to go on the ground and struggling to put up points. Prescott down. And there it is. is. Be intercepted. Picked off by Nasir oh. and the Chargers are going to take possession. I knew it was a mistake when I threw it. Because you were just sitting there. Charles, obviously, all they needed was a field goal to do that. They wanted the touchdown. Unfortunately, but you're going to make a mistake, too, son. And you know every too offense concerned. talks about the same thing each week, don't they, Brandon? I ain't too concerned. Every drive with a kick, whether it's a field goal attempt, a point after the touchdown, or worst, a punt. This time they had that opportunity, but didn't get it. Because you know the that might be a mistake. close to the end zone, and that allows a defense to tighten up their coverage, and they pick that. Tighten up, off. tighten up. This pass finds its way to Williams. Yeah, yeah you, you try to slow grind it. I'm going to pick it. You just play good football. I can't do nothing with you. game in the fourth quarter. They understand the situation. They don't need to be in any rush. Go ahead and huddle up and run your offense. That last completion put them in a nice position to take the lead in this game. J-Ron Curse in on the tackle. Yeah, I don't know if it's exactly a win-win, but if you're on offense, you'll take that kind of a run, all right? It was kind of stacked up, found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. Meanwhile, Herbert's throw Ooh. taken in by Cook. What the fuck was get that? This one across the 45 before he's brought down. Getting down to the good stuff. All tied with two minutes remaining. If I lose this to a field goal, you deserve it. That was just dumb. So it's Charger football as we welcome you back from the two-minute warning. They've got it first and ten as they search for a go-ahead score. And the Out of bounds. Sideline here is caught, but they'll rule it incomplete. Couldn't keep his feet in. Second down. An incomplete pass on first down that leads to a second and ten. Now Herbert. How did I miss that pick? This time he's got it. That ball went and through his chest. First down here as the wow. tackles made Come the Cowboys on. 35. Herbert gonna throw. He dumps it to Eckler underneath. And yep, it's over down, with. But not before they're inside the Because EA just gonna fuck me now. Thank you. I'm standing in front of him. We say it often, Charles, but I'm standing in front of him. Equally, and that is a big one here in a tie ball. Now I got to get him field goal right. Brandon, when games are this close, it usually comes down to the team making the fewest mistakes, and that was one of our mantras back in Tennessee. Coach Major say all the time, the team making the fewest mistakes will win. No, I got to get a field goal. Give yourself an opportunity. And he's taken down <sighs> at the 45. Shit, I don't line. like this. A big play that time through the air. 31 yards. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield. It's first and 10 to the 45. Here's Dak. 
Good solid football. And he's got this down to the 35. Pardon, you gotta like what they're doing right there. Little by little, they're getting closer. Another good pickup. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on Let first and 10. Now Dak. They'll get this out wide here to Elliott. Now the Cowboys are gonna burn the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 12 seconds to go in the football game. 12 seconds, I still got a timeout. Oh, I can kick it from here. On second down, Elliott. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. Now they get the timeout. It leads you to wonder, will they kick it here or risk running another play and possibly not getting down in time? We'll see. So it'll all come down to the booming right leg of Greg Zerline. His first attempt of the night here, and it's a big one. It's good game. The win. And his kick is right there. It's good. And it's celebration time on that sideline as they have taken the lead in the final seconds. Well, he was a spectator for much of this game. This is his first field goal opportunity of the entire contest, but he's able to connect. Stay in yeah, bounds, man. good seat to this one, didn't he? But let's face there you it, go. all kickers in the <laughs> Ohio, they want to contribute. They want their opportunity, and he seized his. Well, this one, partner, was fun down to the very end. They got the points late, right before the whistle. Then the ensuing kickoff. They were hoping for magic on the other side, but couldn't get that spark. Fun if you won, <laughs> and fun for us, because we got to watch it and call it. That magic that you were talking about didn't occur at the end, but what a game all the way through. That'll do it for us, for Charles Davis and all our hardworking crew. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, find us on Twitter at EA Madden NFL. Good night, everybody.
Bay Sports coverage of the National Football League brings us to legendary Lambeau Field in Green Bay. We all know this community lives for its Packers, and the green and gold came out of the tunnel a short time ago, and it was loud. We are ready for football. So are they as the Packers get set to match up with the Dallas Cowboys. Mason Crosby of the Packers has it teed up, and off we go from Lambeau. Taken from about the 12. And up to about the 26-yard line, just across the 25. Prescott on first down. A dump off to Elliott. That'll give him eight that time, and it'll bring up a second down. I like it, I like it, I like it. Get everyone involved in the passing game, and you know you can create those great mismatches throwing it to your guys out of the backfield. And on the first drive, that can also help establish some rhythm, right? I think so. It gets everyone involved. They feel like they're part of it. It really gets them amped up as they go forward. From the 35 on second down, Prescott. Call it a gain of a yard, and that is going to set up a third and one. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for offense. On third and one, here's Prescott. He'll get this to Elliott. And he gets this one to midfield before he's brought down. Another catch for him there on this drive, Brandon. And it looks like they're going to utilize him out of the backfield any way they can. And that time, they pick up a first down. So now on defense, do you assign a man to him and try and cover him before he gets going? Target it's Schultz. They'll contain him to just four. Second down. I don't think it's a surprise they're throwing the football early. We expected that. They told us they were going to come out firing, but four for four on the opening drive. They like that. <laughs> they don't just like it, they love it because now everyone gets locked in. Your confidence jumps up. Everyone's easy about what they're doing out there. And by the way, they're looking at the sideline thinking to themselves and expressing, just keep throwing it. We're doing pretty well. He'll go about four here, down to the 33 yard line. Third and short yardage, Prescott. Over the middle, Amari Cooper, it's complete. And he will have a Cowboys first down, and he was able to get it by plenty. A gain of eight on third and three. Got an open man. It's Michael Gallup. And yeah, this will leave him a yard short. Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. And yeah, the pocket's been protected pretty good here so far in the opening drive. We always talk about confidence in runners and catchers and quarterbacks. How about the protection detail? They're not allowing anyone near the guy throwing the football. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. Defensively, they better figure something out. Opening drive, he already has four catches. And if you have to figure out how to stop him defensively, that usually means you weaken your defense. That means that now the offense is doing the dictating, and they should have other things open up as well. 
And that throw behind his man. He missed him incomplete. I know coaches tell us all the time that having a powerful arm isn't the number one thing they look for in a quarterback. But when you're trying to throw inside routes and you need to put some heat on it, it helps have the big gun. In this case, just a little bit too much. Prescott yet again. And he comes back with one complete. Five yards, now it's third and five. And so far, a very nice, methodical opening drive. This has the feel of a scripted drive that they rehearsed perfectly all week long, and now they're executing it on game day. Script looks good so far. It's been a pretty long opening drive. This will be play number 11 coming up on third down. That's in front, that's in front. Picked off by Chris Barnes. And a big sure. turnover there as his guys will get the football running. back. So that's about as long a non-scoring play as you're going to see from inside their own 10 to first and goal. Now Prescott, and that is caught. Touchdown, Cowboys. Ezekiel Elliott there to make the grab. And the Cowboys have taken the early lead on the road here at Lambeau. Zerline connects on the extra point, and it's now a 7-0 game. the touchdown at Zerline. Stay in He'll kick it away. There you go. And here's Lewis. I don't know. It's not good. Oh. And this should be the final play before the quarter ends. Now the man from UTEP, this is Aaron Jones. Able to shake free for about seven up to the 35. Ball, four, After six, one, five, seven, five, nothing on EA Sports. A good run, got seven on first. Here's second and three. Rogers going to give this one to Dillon. And he will lose yardage back to the 34-yard line. He'll lose a yard on the play, so now they need three yards on third down. Rodgers dancing to his left and he can't find a receiver and he's brought down credit the sack to Leighton Vander Esch okay, was it a breakdown in protection did the running back not pick him up what does it really matter sometimes it's just a great play made by the defense big time sack oh a big decision here early look at this they're going to go for it on their own side of the field. Here we go on fourth down with Rodgers. And able to find Alan Lazard. And able to rip mm -hmm. off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped inside the 40. So from Cowboy territory now, here's first and 10 at the 39-yard line. Rodgers' throw complete here on target to Tunyon. They'll contain him to just four, second down. Ran the perfect defense in this situation would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. There he is, and they passed him off to each defender. Ended up making a nice play, even though it was complete. Call it a gain of six on the play, and they'll be faced with a third and in inches. Here 
Rodgers to throw once more. And this pass broken up. And the contact well timed there. And now fourth down. That's a good job there, creating the contact to force the incompletion. And now since it's fourth down, that should set up a field goal situation. And a nice sigh of relief defensively to be able to hold them to three. They'll run it with Jones. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. And they'll keep on the ground with Jones. And they corral him just a couple yards shy of the end zone. First and goal and a chance to get that initial touchdown right back. Jones will take this one in for a Packer touchdown. A strong, determined run there, Charles, to get in for six points. This is why it's such a team game, isn't it? And I know that sounds really generic and it sounds almost trite. But the blocks were made up front, offensive line, collective victory at the line of scrimmage and downfield. And how about the finish to the run all the way into the end zone? So what move. do you think the mindset was there? You can tie it with a PAT here first half. Why go for the lead right now? The old school mindset says if you have a better team, you just go ahead and continue to try and dominate. There's also a school of thought if you don't think you're quite as good, you have to try and take advantage of opportunities. And finally, I just think this is analytics coming into the game. Someone saying the more you go for two, the better your chances are of actually getting them. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. After the long touchdown drive we just saw, you wonder if maybe that's taken a look. Oh, Prescott stripped, but I believe a Cowboy was there to get it. He was, and Dallas will maintain position. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. A reminder, coming up at halftime, Jonathan Coachman will join us from Orlando with our halftime report. But business to take care of before we get there. A two-minute drill before the coaches' two-minute drill. And that is knocked away in the middle of the field and incomplete. You definitely would like to hit on that one because now you get a third and long showing up. And you just know defense is going to be getting after it. They are pinning their ears back and they are coming. Oh, and down he goes. They could not contain Kenny Clark as he gets home for the sack. On is the punter Brian Anger to kick this one away. And he gets it away, a directional kick going toward the sideline. And this one will not be returnable as it sails out of bounds. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And now with still more than a minute to go in what's been a tight game, you figure we'll try to see them move the ball downfield. And remember, they get the kickoff to start the second half, so this is a golden opportunity for them to go down there and put up a couple of sixes back-to-back. -back. What a momentum swing that would be. Yeah, you might be able to get a two-for-one without ever even giving up the football. So that'll back him up five. Following the delay, here's second and nine. Now Rogers. Steps away to his left. Out of the backfield, this is Aaron Jones. The Packers going to use one of their timeouts as they stop it with 16 seconds to go in half number one. Rodgers now on first down. He'll find Jones again, complete. Now a timeout signaled for, and they'll get it with 10 seconds to go before halftime. One of my teammates called me the other day when he was watching the game. He's like, man, trying to watch an NFL game and trying to account for their passing game. 
That's difficult. And just when you think you get everything covered, here comes a back out of the backfield. In this case, he picks up a first down. On first down, Rodgers looking deep for Adams. And this is caught inside the five. And it's a Packers touchdown. Devontae Adams in the final seconds of the first half. And the Packers have taken the lead. So now Rodgers will lead the Packers up to go for two. The final shot before half for Rodgers. And this is going to be caught. It's good. And that extends their lead by two more. So time it up for a kickoff here. Five seconds remaining in this first half. Taken at the 15, a short kick. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. One second, all that remains. Escaping the pressure right. And incomplete on the deep ball. And that'll do it for the end of the second quarter. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. All right, Coach, thanks. Yeah, both teams likely to make some changes in what's been a closely fought battle to this point. So it's the Packers set to receive the kick. They've got the lead as well as we are underway in the third quarter. So they will accept the penalty and move forward. and 10. Here's Rodgers. And that going to be incomplete. Too tough to hold on to that one. It's second down. He did a fine job there of not hitting him before the ball arrived. And I've got to tell you, you can often mistime that play because of the angles of approach. When you're going to get him, sometimes you panic as well and think, I've got to be there right now. Instead, in this case, timed it perfectly and knocked it free. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Open man left side, it's the tight end, Tunyon. And he's going to have a Packers first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Whenever we talk about okay. moving the sticks and controlling the football, there's a great example right there. Those are the third downs you need to convert to win football games. We're in the third quarter of this one, and this is a tight one. In order to maintain pace, keep the ball away from the other team and put points on the board, those are the plays they need to continue to convert. Rodgers will try again on second down. And that's going to be incomplete. Good effort there, trying to take a shot, but it's third down. Tremendous field position there and a perfect time to do exactly what they did. Take a shot at the end zone. And they went for the big play, just unable to complete it. Setting up the screen here, Aaron Jones. And they'll get this one down okay, to about the 20 yard line. And they certainly had success throughout this contest getting him the ball in the passing game. And there he picks up another first down. Whatever they saw going into this one, they've been able to capitalize on it. And no adjustment has been made to take it away. Rodgers now on first down. He's got the hook up to Lazard and able to get this down inside the 15, either the 13 or 14 before he's out of bounds. A gain of six there on first. Working with a second and four. Rodgers with a give, it's Aaron Jones. Call that a loss of a yard, and things get a little more difficult here. Third and five. Rodgers now to throw. Got an open man. It's Valdez Scantling. 
Well, this is going to depend on the spot, but it's not a very generous one. He looks to be about a yard or so short. They get only four that time as that leads us to a fourth down. And boy, is he close. Did he get there? No, they're going to say he's short of the line to gain. The Packers unable to pick up the first. And the Cowboys defense is going to get him the football back. After the penalty, it's Elliott. And he'll take this one only up to about his 13-yard line. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. Prescott to throw it. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's Cooper. And mark him down way up close to the 40 at the 39. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Here's Prescott. Again, it's Cooper as he makes the catch. And able to rip off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped inside the 40. On first down, Elliott. And he's going to get this inside the 30. Under a minute to go in this third quarter as they come up first and 10. Throwing. Prescott throwing the out route incomplete. That's Cooper. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. From down at the 12, it's first and 10. To throw is Prescott. And it's caught. And he can't quite get there. Tackled down at the 1. <laughs> I can't help but chuckle a little bit because at this point, it can't be a surprise to anyone in the building who's going to get the ball. They just keep feeding it over and over. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Zeke Elliott able to find his way in from a yard out. And the Cowboys are an extra point away from tying this ball game here in the final moments of the third quarter. So Dak will bring the Cowboys up to go for the two-point try. Prescott, they're going to throw for it. Toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. I know the natural instinct is to kick the extra point there and tie the game. But here in this spot, at this point of the game, is there another coach maybe weighing in with, with what to do here? Well, I think that analytics are starting to say, with it being from the two, that you're going for two more often, that makes sense. But there, I still like going for one, don't you? Yeah, I do. I mean, that's my first instinct, but I understand how the game is starting to change. And we're getting a number of these quarterbacks who are telling their coaches, we should go for two all the time. I want to see if we ever get a team that actually starts to do that. About set to get this drive started. The Green Bay offense at the line. They'll start the drive with a carry by Jones. And he'll maneuver his way forward for about four, second and six. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Throwing now is Rodgers. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's Lewis. And he'll be out of bounds right at the 40. Well, that should be a reminder defensively, and I think it's a reminder to myself because you just can't sell out to stop the run. There's still enough time that this offense can move the football through the air, even on first and second downs. And they obviously picked the right spot to throw the ball there. And not much room to operate as he'll get this up only to about the 41. On second and nine, Rodgers. That's complete to Lazard. That catch good for five. It's third down. Now the toss to Jones, running right. And no room that time, getting it to about the 46. Just a yard on the run there, and that's going to bring us to a fourth down. They'll go for it. It's Rodgers. And he's brought down. Can't do anything with the football. It's a sack, and it's hard. Downs. The Packers unable to pick up the first. And Dallas, they'll take over in terrific field position. Prescott looks to throw on first. 
Got his man there complete to Gallup. And he's taken down inside the 30. And here we are in the fourth quarter, partner, and we watch him drive for what would be a go-ahead touchdown. And you and I both know this is where you need a quarterback who can keep his cool back there, not just for himself, but to keep the rest of the team relaxed, too. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down, second and right at a yard. He's been quiet today in the passing game, just his second catch. Yeah, and people have to come up with schemes to limit him, and, and what a lot of teams do, They'll double him, you know, use a linebacker underneath, a safety over the top. Sometimes they'll just take a corner, maybe their third corner if he's a bigger guy, and put him on a man-to-man -to, -man to try and limit his touches. Just keep mixing it up, give him different angles, different looks, like a good boxer does. Fourth quarter, two minutes on the clock in a tight one-point game. has been a familiar sight all afternoon as they stop him behind the line. On second down, it's Elliott. And now they're inside the 10 as he's brought down at the 9. The Packers going to use one of their timeouts as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. Scott. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Put to it by Chris Barnes. And the Packers have just about sewn up this football game. Just when you thought this game might be turned on its ear, a late interception pretty much going to seal the deal. Yeah, boy, talk about having your backs to the wall. This defense, they look like they were in danger of surrendering this lead, but they knew they needed that one play, and they got it right there, partner. So they come up on second down, and they can get another run like we just saw. Would likely put an end to this thing. Again, it's Jones. And they're able to bring him down at the 20. Not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and 10. The Cowboys going to use their second timeout now. And they'll be disappointed to have to burn one there after giving up the first down. They'll try and run some clock now with Jones. And he stopped right at the 25 after a gain of five. The first down run got five. Here's second and five. From the shotgun again to Jones. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. The Cowboys signal for their third and final timeout as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game. And on third down, the Cowboys bring in an extra defensive back. Rodgers to throw. And it's complete to Adams. And he's going to have a Packers first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Now Rodgers. And down he goes at the 49, a three-yard pickup. Well, offensively, that's the mismatch that you want. You want to force a linebacker to try and cover your back out of the backfield, out in some open space. The linebackers nowadays, they run like backs, and they take a lot of pride in covering. What a nice play he made there in the open field. through the entire second half, but the first half output, that's enough to carry them to victory. And that's an odd game to watch, isn't it? Because when we saw the output in the first half, you think to yourself, okay, they've got something working here. They know what they're doing. They'll continue that along. But instead, it's goose eggs in the second half. Fortunately, enough of a cushion and enough defense to carry them home.
So that'll just about do it for Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, log on to easports.com. The Packers are winners here as we say so long from Lambeau.